Four North County high school students will put their best drone skills to the test at the International Aerial Drone Competition at UCSD. As ABC 10 News reporter Steve Smith tells us, they're in it to win it and to maybe even find a future career. It's definitely an exciting time when it comes to drones. The job market is ever expanding. And then there is the sporting aspect, and that's the lure for younger flyers. You know, there's a magical thing about competition that makes it really exciting. So students learn all of the skill sets without knowing that they're learning. Just flying them is kind of cool and how like you can get off the ground and you can like control them remotely. I just think it's really interesting that we're able to create these like machines that are able to just hover in midair. This Saturday, 14 teams comprised of middle school and high school students will compete in the International Aerial Drone Competition including a team from Carmel Valley. There's two parts to the competition, so you can fly a drone manually or programming. And you have two minutes to like get as many points as possible doing various tasks. In our manual round, we'll be controlling a drone with a controller. So you have to fly drones through these hoops to get points. And also um, going through a blackout zone. It's not that tough. So for these kids, flying these drones all relates to STEM, science, technology, engineering, and math. And it's a lot of fun. It's a great way to learn about like programming and um, different aspects of computer science. Because you can implement lots of different STEM techniques. Like um, computer coding is one of the big things that are implemented in, program in drone programming. So it's very interesting and very cool. And while the goal this weekend is to perform well in competition, this skill set can help these kids later in life. Possibly later on, they becoming their drone pilot or they will be with their code, they will be working at bigger companies like Google, Apple, um, Qualcomm. Steve Smith, ABC 10 News. We are rooting for him. This Saturday's competition at UCSD is a qualifying event. The top three teams will move on to the national finals. This 10 News Pinpoint Weather Report is sponsored by Anderson Plumbing.